Only about half of Nigeria's population has access to basic sanitation services, and a quarter of this number practice open defecation with dire consequences to public health and the environment. Key stakeholders raised this concern at the opening of a national workshop on the safety uh, managed sanitation. Uh, TVC News correspondent Kevin Balogo. Access to safely managed sanitation is a fundamental human right, but millions of people across the globe lack this access. In Nigeria, only 18% of the population has access to safely managed services, leaving more than 6% without access to basic sanitation. Thank you, this gathering of experts in the water and sanitation sector are meeting to bring up discussions on the right steps to improve sustainable sanitation for all citizens through innovation, policy frameworks, community engagement, and behavioral change. Provision of safely managed services is very, very, it has many factors that it contributes. One, it improves the health of the nation, the health status of the nation. It also improves the income of the nation because any, color, any nation that has health challenges, you can see that that will also affect its productivity. So these are the challenges that we are trying to see how we can prevent. I mean, also mention that if, this, if Nigeria does not have a safely managed sanitation system, we cannot defeat the hundreds of waterborne diseases like cholera. The Sustainable Development Goal target 6.2 for sanitation six that by 2030 there should be an improvement in access to adequate and equitable sanitation and hygiene for all and end open defecation, paying special attention to the needs of women and girls and those in vulnerable situations. But with just six years to this target, Nigeria still remains far behind. Now we really raised the bar to universal access and of course universal access to safely managed uh, and uh, so we all just have to keep refining our skills and getting better at doing what we know how to do uh, but to to meet these new goals according to a 2012 report by the world bank nigeria loses an estimated 455 billion naira annually due to the use of unsanitary toilets and open defecation Achieving the SDG target 6.2 will require the government to make five times the current pros and triple all investments in the sector in order to improve safe and sustainable sanitation for all citizens. Kemi Balogun, TVC News, Abuja.